I, you know, I'm a big sports fan. Like I like sports, uh, stuff like that. I watched golf. We were talking about that earlier. Uh, UFC I've got into. I think UFC, uh, I would, as a regular guy that watched sports, UFC does right now, I think the best job of like getting me, like getting the me's of the world that just I'm used to. I know football, baseball, basketball, golf. Like I know kind of the main ones. And I think UFC is doing the greatest job in all of sports to to attract me. Like, a, and I would think I'm a, you know, an average American. Just in how they've done that. What, what? They, you guys talking about how good people are is big. So uh, uh, once I found out like that, John Jones. I love like once in a lifetime athletes. Mm. When you get like a LeBron, Michael Jordan, you get these things that you're like, we're lucky to even get to see a guy like this. Right. And so. And I see that John Jones is that. And I hear about John Jones being that. Like, I, like, G, George, GSP, I never saw GSP. I was never, I saw him fight Bisping was the only fight. And I know that he's the great, but UFC wasn't in my world. Back then. Back then. When he was a champ. Yeah. And so, I go John Jones. I think Conor McGregor's probably, you know, in a sense of, like, this kind of Tiger Woods of just getting people excited about this sport. That you're mm -hmm. like, well, I love this dude. This dude's crazy. Which then got, then introduced me to Khabib, so then I see Khabib, and now I'm fascinated by Khabib because you're like, oh, this him and John Jones are these once in a lifetime mm -hmm. kind of guys, and so like, oh, I I love that, and I so I want to watch these once, like I want to watch because I'm like, these guys are they're not normal, and so we should be, I should be seeing these, and I think UFC does that. I understand Usman when he said like, show some respect to my name. I get it because in my, at me, I almost did it. I watched the fight, but I almost did it. If I had something come up, I might not have watched it because that's because Usman's not. I didn't know completely, and then after I watched it and I hear y'all talk about him and you explain how good this guy really is, I'm like, oh, I'll never miss another fight of him now. Mm, yeah, because I because it, you know, we don't know anything about the sport really. So when you're telling me like, hey, you're lucky to be. You know, in a, in a sense, but we're lucky to be watching these guys. Right. This is not normal. You right. know, John Jones was when he fought Daniel Cormier. Like, I didn't know really Cor Cor Cormier, right? And I, I didn't really know him. So I see John Jones beat him. And then I'm like, okay. And then Daniel Cormier fights uh, Stipe. Stipe. Next. Stipe Miocic. The one he beat yeah. and he destroyed him. And then I go, oh, that's how good John Jones is. Like I'm like, because you know, John Jones looks so dominant. Yeah. That, and then I see Daniel, and you're like, oh, Daniel's like one of the greatest. Yeah. And then you're like, oh, that guy's even be like putting these pieces together is huge. Yeah, champions that beat champions. It's yeah. and when that gets explained, I think UFC's doing the best job of explaining that kind of thing. 